Hey everybody and welcome back to oh to Spunky. When we last left off. Well that was a good episode, wasn't it? I had so much money. And I was close to getting into the black market when all of a sudden I got killed. And I reviewed the footage as I always do when I edit. And I got so cheated. What happened was uh, I fell through ooh. The um, tree that was stood on, I fell through the leaves of it, and that's why I ended up falling down instead of jumping over. And that is why it was almost magical watching it in slow motion because I just seemed to gently glide straight into the mouth of uh, this piranha. Piranha? That's not the right word. I'm thinking Peaky Piranha from Mario. The chompy, chomping, man eating plant. Good that I bombed in here. Machete, I'll take that. Uh, I was thinking I could get in from the bottom, but I thought probably not. It's the right decision to do, especially since I got that. I'm not going to bomb in for the dog. Reason being, I'm fairly confident right now so that I don't think I'll need his one extra piece of life. I'm going to use a rope there. That one extra piece of life shouldn't. Uh, matter. If there was a sacrificial altar I would have considered taking it but nah. I'm not a big fan of the machete but uh, it does have its uses such as <laughs> such as uh, spiderwebs. It is so good it just destroys spiderwebs. And I want to go up here. Oh I must got him on the way down. Was that weather coming up here? Yeah, I'd say so. Right, so at the end of level 1 we have over 20,000 money. Which is amazing. That gets us done completely for level 2. And a quarter of the way through level 3. That's my personal rule of trying to attain 10,000 per level, by the way. Uh, bombs. Excellent. Ropes. Could do with some more. But ropes are easy enough to come by. And are very cheap. And... Well, this could come in handy. How am I going to do this? Ah, then that one will fall down. Okay. Oh, it just vanished. I thought the brick would have fallen down, but... No, it just vanished. Put that there. We can now grab the key. It's very rare to have uh, something so simple as this. i being able to plug that in. Nice and easy. I could really do a snake pit for a pickaxe because there's so much treasure lying around in these. Um, in fact, no, that won't work. I thought I could maybe blast two red jewels out in one bomb, but no, they're too far away. All right, gotta find me some treasure. Compass down there. I will pick that up. It is always good to have a compass. Always good to know where the end of the level is. Especially Especially, we'll get some ropes as well while we're here. Uh, it's especially good to have a compass once you've uh, been to the black market. Because at that point, it's just you just want to get out of the level as quick as possible. You don't need to focus on getting money and other stuff. Pow! And you, and you. Don't have any of your crap. Oh, we didn't need to buy any ropes. But, you know, it's good to have spare, I guess. There is a cobra that is going to kill me. Can we do this? No, I I dropped my knife. That was not good. Right then. No, no, no. Grip to the side. That was lucky. Yeah. And you. And then we're coming up here for you. Pow. Yeah, so I don't usually use the machete that much. I'm not a big fan of it, but it's coming in coming in very handy. I don't know what happened. I tried to jump across. Yeah, I'm just trying to wrap my head around that. I knew there was a trap there. I wouldn't have deliberately jumped down. I think I was trying to jump across. Oh! I didn't quite make it. Now this is doubly annoying. Uh, not only have I lost almost all my health, but the dog is in here. 
which means it is impossible for me to take him unless I buy kisses, which I'm not going to do. I am not that kind of explorer. Pow. Um, that means there was no other dog on the level. I'm here. And if there's no other dog on the level, oh, parachute. God damn. If there's another dog on the level, that means I'm stuck with this one health until at least the next area. We're not going to go anywhere near that scorpion. That could end our reign right here. Oh, oh, hey. That was tricky. Right, we want to get... How far was it? I only have three bombs left. It was in here, was it? Yes. Please be worth it. Well, I've already got a parachute, so... Another parachute! Not happy. Oh, so much money I'm having to leave because of the bomb situation. I need more bombs. I'm not happy with that double parachute, though. That is just ridiculous. Oh, snap. I think I can sacrifice this scorpion. Yeah. Just get rid of him. I don't want him coming back to bite me in the butt. I would like to get down there. I think I can, though. So we can actually just go around. Get that to launch. Ooh, a red jewel. No. 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 The thing is, when you have one health, you take levels so tentatively. You get so paranoid or anything. Ah, scorpion in there. That was quite lucky. Get down. No, no. I can't kill it. Its blood would have splashed. And, uh, if it's Hang over the edge. If it's blood splashed, then that explosive would have gone off. Yeah, this is where I want to get. Look, all this money. All I'm asking for, really, is a chance to spend it. You know, we did so well on that first level in terms of money, and then the rest of the levels have kind of sucked, haven't they? I was so preoccupied with not having that spider fall on my head. Completely forgot about Skellywags. Seven minutes, not good. I apologise. Tomorrow is Saturday, which means two more runs with this explorer before we change across. For now, though, goodbye.